more leaders who received a call from Narendra Modi. Annamalai is one of them. So he has also received the call is what we're learning. Now this is very interesting because Kya Namalai, despite having led the BJP in Tamil Nadu and having had made several promises, remember could not deliver when it came to Coimbatore, the seat where he contested. But we have Payal joining us with more details. Kya Namalai has received the call, Payal. What more are we learning? Uh, is this just limited to meet and greet or can there be more in store for him as per the BJP? You know, you're invited to this meet and greet only if you're going to be a part of the Modi cabinet. You know, that's as simple as that, you know, uh, Prithi. But, you know, having said that, yes, Mr. Annamalai has worked uh, over the last couple of years, tried to put BJP on the Tamil Nadu map, a party which does not have any resonance as well, has seen their vote percentage coming up really big, you know, as far as uh, uh, these elections are concerned. And that's the reason it's been very important to see that really. <clears throat> the growth journey as far as the BJP is concerned, Kya Namal leading it from the front. Okay, all right. Kya Namal, I remember, has led the BJP charge in Tamil Nadu. In fact, let's not forget his months-long yatra as well, uh, which was witnessed in Tamil Nadu. And a lot of hopes really were pinned on Kya Namalai. Though this is in, a self, in itself uh, a reflection of how Kya Namalai has worked hard for the party in Tamil Nadu and that's perhaps being recognized by the BJP. If he gets a call and he's going to be part of uh, the tea function that's going to take place at Narendra Modi's residence, that's big news in itself. Let me quickly take in a word from Aman if he's still with us. Aman, very interesting. All right, before that, we have uh, Mr. Sarvanan of the DMK joining us on the phone line. Mr. Sarvanan, what do you make of this? We're learning of a tea event that's going to take place at uh, PM designate Narendra Modi's residence at 11.30 a.m. And Kyanamala is interestingly uh, one of those who've received the call, which means he's going to be rewarded by the party. Let him be rewarded by the party. Uh, that will be beneficial to him. And it will not be beneficial to the state of Tamil Nadu or the people of Tamil Nadu, because BJP is a party which is consistently ignored the welfare of the people of Tamil Nadu. That is why they were routed out here. They did not even get a single seat. We swept the polls. The people of Tamil Nadu are aware of the evil designs of the BJP. There were ministers earlier from Tamil Nadu in uh, the union cabinet, but they were of no use, not even work five paise for the state of Tamil Nadu. The same will continue with Mr. Anamalai. Hmm. No, but the fact, that, the fact that he may just asking. get a portfolio, Mr. Sarvanan, what do you make of that? Uh, is it the party's belief that given that there's been an increase in the vote share, given that he's been able to pose a tough challenge to the opposition, rather their opposition, uh, the ruling DMK in Tamil Nadu, what do you think, where is this sentiment in the BJP coming from, as per your understanding? See, uh, the biggest question is this. Why this Godi media is not questioning the internal quarrel? That is, the BJP, Tamil Nadu BJP is imploding. There are several allegations against Mr. Anamalai that he is responsible for anti-social elements and criminals get forced in the BJP. And he has set up a war room on trolling senior leaders like Dr. Tamilisai Soundarajan, a former governor. What does the central leadership think of this? Why the central leadership is silent on this? The media, the Godi media... Which no, was perhaps perhaps the, the, the idea can also be, Mr. No. Sarvanan, that he'll be moved no, to the national it. capital. And that that may lead to a change of equations in Tamil Nadu. Remember the AIDMK BJP split. So we could see a lot of reversals in that sense. Please don't give me a about the Tamil Nadu's politics. I am asking you a question. Hmm. Why are you not covering these allegations, these stark allegations against Mr. Anamalai. Are you going to still remain the same way how you were behaving in the last 10 years? The people of this country will reject this Godi media if you are going to peddle the agenda of the BJP so in the coming days. So nobody is peddling anyone's this agenda. We are all talking in the realm of speculation. And we're, we're all trying to do a little math here. Let's not get aggressive. No, it's, 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 it's Sunday morning and there's lots more lined up for the day. And this is just one trying to decode what the BJP thinking may be all about. But thank you for sharing your perspective this morning. Let's quickly